like I just when you're talking about like the things that we can do I would just say go through your day and ask yourself what are you putting yourself and your body through that is necessary is a convenience or is unnecessary you know and I love the grounding because I think that grounding which is a, a putting your physical body on the earth without shoes on, you could lay in the grass, whatever. I believe that is one of the greatest neutralizers <clears throat> of energy, of toxins, and all of the things that we can do on top of cutting some of this stuff out of our daily life. Yeah, it's funny that you mentioned that one specifically too, because for whatever reason, that one keeps looping in my mind. And it's not even something that I can say that I'm actively practicing. Like mm -hmm. sometimes when I'm like, oh, I got to go outside to do X, Y, Z, walk, like I have a garden. So if I'm going to watch the garden, I'll be like, you know what? Maybe I'll walk in my bare feet or whatever, mm -hmm. like just in the moment. But I don't make a conscious effort to be like every day I'm going to go out and get my feet on the ground for X number of minutes or whatever. And then and... you have to be mindful not to go if you treat your lawn, right? So you might be better off going to a park or a place that they don't treat their lawn. If you do use fertilizer or chemicals on your own lawn, you might want to go to a place where obviously they don't use chemicals. 